The 10 Most Dangerous Insects. The 10 Most Dangerous Insects. Number 10, the brown tail moth. The seemingly benign brown tail moth is an invasive caterpillar found only on the coast of Maine and Cape Cod in the United States. If you touch its poisonous hairs, you could develop dermatitis, a severe skin irritation. Even airborne hairs can cause a reaction or serious respiratory distress if you inhale them. You could feel a painful rash that could last a few hours to several days for sensitive individuals. Uh, good luck and brace yourself, dude. Number nine, the pus caterpillar. This furry looking creature is one of the most toxic creatures in the United States. It deserves its toxic toupee nickname. Don't be fooled by its fuzzy coat. If you touch it, its tiny toxic spines would inject venom into your skin. And you'd feel excruciating pain that can last for up to 12 hours. You could feel feverish and nauseous, and you'd likely have muscle cramps, swollen glands, and an itchy red rash. To treat it, you'd need to remove the spines using tape or a commercial facial peel. Number 8. The Maricopa Harvester Ant Beware of these ants. They won't cower if you provoke them. They can be found mainly in the southwestern United States. And they have one of the most toxic venoms. Twelve stings could kill a two-kilogram rat. A swarm of them could be lethal to humans. And that could happen thanks to an alarm pheromone that chemically alerts other ants nearby. They bite and sting, leading to potentially lethal allergic reactions and severe pain lasting up to four hours. Number seven, the Asian giant hornet. Asian giant hornets are better known as murder hornets. If you're stung, you could feel unbearable pain for hours due to their neurotoxic venom. You'd feel dizzy and develop an allergic reaction. There is no anti-venom, but epinephrine could help in case of a severe reaction. But if you're stung multiple times, they could murder you. Ugh. Talk about nightmare fuel. <laughs> Number six, the Arizona Bark Scorpion. You could guess where the Arizona Bark Scorpion comes from just by its name, right? <laughs> well done. You'd mainly find it in the deserts in the southwestern United States. And while it doesn't bark, it certainly has bite. It's the only species of scorpion with venom toxic enough to be fatal. It's made of neurotoxins that can be dangerous to your nervous system. You could develop anaphylaxis, which is a severe, life-threatening allergic reaction. Many adults can survive their stings, but kids can experience difficulty breathing, muscle twitching, drooling, sweating, high blood pressure, and vomiting. But don't worry, these nocturnal creatures won't sting you unless provoked or attacked. Number five, the black widow spider. Wait, it still deserves to be on this list because just one bite could seriously affect your nervous system. Even if you're slightly affected by it, you could experience severe pain, itching, and swelling. It could also cause muscle stiffness and partial paralysis of your legs. You could have difficulty breathing and severe abdominal pain. But for young children, the bites can be fatal. Oh, somebody please think of the children! Number four, the brown recluse spider. Here's another arachnid. You can find the brown recluse spider in many southern regions of the United States. It's called recluse because it's shy and avoids humans, but when it does encounter humans, its bite is highly venomous. But don't worry, 90% of the bites heal on their own, without scarring. But 
you might develop volcano lesions. These are nasty lesions that are red, white, and blue. Ingrenous tissue can leave open wounds as large as the human hand. You'd feel immediately itchy and experience chills, fever, and <laughs> nausea. It would take up to eight weeks or longer to recover and you'd have permanent scars. Number three, blister beetles. These beetles have been highly sought after since the 1800s because they produce the chemical cantharin. Nowadays, this compound is used to remove warts, but it could also cause a severe dermatitis reaction. If you touch the beetle and then rub your eyes, you could develop conjunctivitis. My eyes! Washing with soap and water would ease the irritation, but you'd need to seek medical attention. And if you swallowed a blister beetle by accident, it could be fatal. Ugh. I'd get better snacks if I were you. Number two, centipedes. Centipedes are the most dangerous and downright scary arthropods in the world. But don't freak out, not all of them are this deadly. Mainly the big ones you'll find in Southeast Asia, Hawaii, and tropical regions. They only bite humans when they feel threatened, delivering their fast-acting venom. If one bit you, you'd get two puncture wounds. Your affected limb would be swelling. you feel extreme localized pain, and you could also experience induration, which is localized hardness in your skin. Medical attention is important if the symptoms are grave. You could die by a secondary infection. And number one, the cow killer. The cow killer looks like an ant, but it's a type of wasp. The wingless female has a sting so powerful it could kill cattle. Hence the name, Smart Cookie. It has venom in its saliva and its stinger, so if you get stung and bitten, you'd get a double dose. That double jab would knock you out, but you would survive its bite. A kid or a person with a poor immune system could be at risk, though. Now, for some of these creatures, an antivenom exists, but for most, severe reactions are treated using epinephrine because the reactions are generally due to an allergy to the venom. Now, if you think these are bad, imagine being <coughs> allergic to everything. <coughs> I'm sorry.